What's your most wanted sexual fantasy? Like and subscribe, or else these will be in your bed tonight. Never again sorting comments by controversial. And here we go. I want to spy on two people fucking then find a girl hoss also spying on them, and fuck her while we spy. Damn, that's hot now that I think about it. I found a video like that years and years ago. Sadly many all excavations have failed to find it. We must make our plea here to the reddit gods. To be pinned down, and for my partner to just take what he wants. Like, one time I was teasing him by not letting him kiss me, and he held my hands above my head, and forced me to kiss him, and it was the hottest thing. Thinking about it now is driving me crazy. I'd also love for him to come in me, but we really don't need slash can't have a kid RN, so even though I'm on the pill I still have him pull out. I'm male, and with roles reversed this is mine thing as well. But it's hard as I'm stupid as fuck, and could read signals wrong. Just really passionate aggressive sex honestly. I read this as passive aggressive. Does this feel good? Yes. It does. Oh. Okay. A few hot friends are sleeping over, and we stay up really late and accidentally oversleep, so we all have to shower together to save time. I have a shower that could easily fit 6 people in it. There's never been more than one. Sad face, but winking. I'm going to just assume this means you're sad about not having group 6, while still telling us that you masturbate in your giant shower. Hot steamy 6, that is not interrupted by kids or pets. Yeah bro don't you just hate it when the dog joins in. Chicken on a tire swing. I lay under it. Dig hard. Inserted. Spin that tire swing. Be blade. Let it rip. To fuck two girls in a hot about side a cabin in the woods. I don't know why. But I had a dream about it once and ever since it's been my hash one sexual fantasy. Hot tub sex sucks my dude. The water washes away any kind of lubrication and they're a literal cesspool of bacteria. Party in the tub, fuck on the flannel, yeah right. But it was in my dream, so I got her included. Fucked by a professor for better grades, almost getting caught giving him head under his desk then being dominated, being roughly handled against his desk in the classroom. Seems like you want that PhD. Being tied to a bedpost and fed pasta. Mario and Luigi appear in the doorway. Here we go. I just want a hot MILF to take interest in me and let me fuck her brains out. I'm already 28, this fantasy won't be possible for much longer. I've wanted to fuck an older woman since high school, but the older I get the closer it gets to regular sex, slash. Foursome with my coworkers in the back room, I work at Starbucks, and I'm the only guy. Keep going. I'm frapping over here already. Two pumps of toffee nut in a tall blonde, extra cream. And now I'll never be able to feel the same when I have my grand toffee nut lat. I'm the dom in our relationship, but sometimes I really want her to take charge. Always being the responsible one can get tiring after a while. She tried topping me once, and she was very uncomfortable with it. Edit, whoa, this blew up way more than I expected. Let me clarify that I'm extremely happy being the dom 95% of the time my fantasies is me giving the orders, doling out the funishments, and patting daddy's good girl on the head after a hard session in the bedroom, or living room, or kitchen, or dark alley. However, 5% of the time I want to be the one being bossed around, being told what to do, and being used like a sex toy for my baby Gerald. We've spoken about this before, and while she does her best, it's just not quite right. I don't like forcing her to do something she doesn't really enjoy, and if she doesn't enjoy it then I don't enjoy it. Otherwise we have an amazing sex life, and I'm very lucky to have my precious little sub. Talk dirty in a foreign language, while kissing my neck. I'm kind of ashamed of it, but I want to be used like a sex slave. I'm way more ashamed of wanting to treat one or more girls like sex slaves. I feel like it's a manifestation of some inner complex or something. DKY, but me and another girl, preferably someone I adore, giving a blowjob together and kissing at the top when he comes. Then we all make breakfast naked in the kitchen, giggling and touching butts. Basic, but so much harder to achieve than you would think. 
I'm shy and I have wilder fantasies plenty often, but this one is at the top of the list for some reason. You're poor in barks. I've had threesome several times through the past 9 years, but I've always fantasized about having my boyfriend duplicated. Not different guys but all him, with everything, the bedroom knowledge, knowing how I tick. Just overwhelming attention on the best level. So like the movie Watchmen. Yes. Exactly like that scene, but with no weird glowing men doing it, so they don't have to pay attention to me lol. Plenty of fanstases, but something small that is kinda realistic, I really want them to accidentally break something whilst everything's going on. Like blindly looking for a support, but breaking a lamp slash vase in the process, but we just carry on after having a brief laugh. Know what I mean? Getting plowed by two guys. They can high five each other to IDC. Eiffel Tower. I want to wear a strap on like a tail, and do two women doggy style at the same time like a pendulum occasionally switching sides. We're all living in 2019 and this guy is living in 3019. 3069. Facetting. Man, why does it seem so hard to find a woman that's down with this? Just, have a seat. It's been my experience that women don't like this because it makes them feel insecure about their weight. It's unfortunate too, but because a women grinding your face is so hot. I once had a dream that an older gentleman, in 30s, he was probably 40s or 50s, propositioned me by suggesting he fuck my brains out. I turned him down and told him it was because his house was a mess. He promptly started cleaning up his house. I've never been more turned on, and I still think about it to this day. Edit, since this blew up somehow, let me clarify, I was turned on because he was willing to clear any obstacles that might be in the way of his initial proposition, he wanted me that bad. Also, it was just a dream. Also, one can be attracted to older people without having daddy issues. Also, stop commenting back quote Monica, because it's been commented 1000 times and you're not original. Is that because someone was frantically cleaning, because they wanted sex with you so badly? Or was the cleaning itself the turn on? A super attractive woman who's taller than me, I'm 6 feet 2, being dommy all over. She fucks me silly, and I'm little spoon for the night. She makes me feel small slash insignificant, but still at the end of the night she loves me. Attainable, a curvy woman, taller than me, that lets me experiment on her with an arsenal of sex toys, until she's a shuddering mess. Unattainable, a dragoness, HMM yes the classic thick dragon gf. Donkey has entered the chat. Well I'm a BDSM switch so, mine would have to be torturing the ever living fuck out of a sub, and then having them suddenly switch on me as a revenge move. Well that's my new fantasy, thank you there. As a switch who finds it really hard to sub without a fight this sounds great. I'm a woman and I would love you to just once be able to have sex as a man. I'm dying of curiosity. Must be wicked rad the way dudes are after it nonstop. Edit, well this old broad certainly wasn't expecting all these comments about balls first thing in the am. Happy Monday, fellas lols. And thanks for the silver. That's fun. Now, nah. It's more like, having a really persistent itch, so irritating and bad you can't help but scratch it. Now imagine that itch is inside your balls. Bows, imagine having bows. Cloning my husband, so we can have a threesome. To be able to come during sex. No, seriously it's never happened. Same here. Don't know if you're female or not but a majority can't remember the actual statistic. It's like 75% of women find it hard to come during sex and need some other stimuli. Coming home to my b-girlfriend and she's already midfuck with another b-girl. I hop in and disappoint them both. A big titty edge Errol feeds me snacks, while we watch Avatar The Last Airbender and afterwards there are no crumbs on the sheets. The no crumbs has got to be the best part. Was gonna say my boyfriend and I have almost this exact relationship, but there are definitely crumbs on the sheets. I've always fantasized about being pinned to a wall by someone that's crazy about me. With another woman, dad lesbian stuff, I'd like to edit that I've fantasized about one particular girl and am B, but already in a relationship with someone else. 
so it's only a fantasy for me. An orgy with all the girls I've had a crush on. Have a fully be threesome with me a guy and a girl. BJ sandwich. My wife and some other hot chick. Ugh, I instantly imagined some girl biting my dick. Having a threesome with my wife and her twin. He'd probably never go for it, though.